During reprogramming, or getting ready to reprogram, you may have questions about a particular OEM subscription, where to obtain it, how much does it cost, if there's any known issues with that car manufacturer, and so on. What we have built into the Ease Reprogramming Assistant is a one location to link to all OEMs to find out this particular type of information. Let's just open up the tool. And you can pick any manufacturer you want, just as by way of example, I'm going to open up the GMSPA. Right now I'm connected to an interface, but you don't have to be. And in every single service programming assistant right here at the top under help, just click the very first menu option. It's going to say contents or something similar, but it'll be the top line. Open up that. That's going to open up a web page, and you'll see all the car manufacturers listed here. And let's just pick, um, we'll pick GM since we're on GM right now. But again, once you're in here, you can link to all of them. And what you're going to find under all these links for each car manufacturer is a link of the website of where you would go to get their reprogramming information. Um, some information on what can be reflashed, um, calibration lookup information, where you would go for that. If there's any known issues or tips or help, if there's any cables that need to be um, used in addition, you'll find that here. Subscription details, the cost associated with it um, for the various terms how to reach the particular OEM tech support line if you need help from the car manufacturer and any kind of uh, PC specifications again how to set up your PC and there will be reprogramming video links here now we're changing all this right now as I'm recording some of these there's one here right now for GM but again there will probably be a link here to several other videos in the very near future okay so that's GM let's take a look at Ford I'll just show you that's you know again it's very similar so let's take a look at Ford here. Again, you can see the link to the Ford's website, what can be reflashed, some additional, additional information on PATS, again, calibration lookup, issues, and you can see it's very similar to GM. And there's where the video is for Ford. Now let's take a look at something like, um, say, Toyota. Again, here's the Toyota website. If I click on that, it'll open it right up reported issues with Toyota. Again, this is just going to open up another screen. You'll see them all listed here. Here's Toyota. No current issues for Toyota. You can scroll through that and see some of the other ones. And again, some of the stuff in here is really just related to additional cables or particular um, vehicles that they might be currently experiencing an issue with. So if you do have an issue, um, please check here first. And again, that's it. So again, from any SPA manufacturer that you're in there, just click on help, click contents or at the very top line, it might say OEM specific help or something like that. It's going to open up this website and again just click on um, any particular OEM. Let's take a quick look at Chrysler and again you can see all the same type of information.